Hi hello everyone welcome to the channel so in this video I'm going to show you how to make the layer and label visibility depend on map scale in RGIS Pro so now let's get started so in the table of contents section you can able to visualize we have a, a layer called places railroad state provinces countries and a base map of world ocean base so we're going to make the layer visibility is to depend on the current scale of the map so here you can able to visualize I have a map zoomed to the extent of Australia with all layers and the, the label for the sites is being turned on here the places name here. So now let me click the full extent button on our uh, the map tab section so that we can see the whole world at once. So navigate to this option and click this option called full extent. So now you can able to visualize here the full extent of the map. So here, the first thing that strikes me is that there are so many places uh, you can able to visualize at this scale so that they pretty much uh, hides other layers. So now let me zoom back to my study area here. So now we are zoomed into the country called Australia here. So you can able to visualize here the points in the place uh, layer here. It looks kind of messy uh, in this scale, uh, kind of the falling on top of one another in some places. You can able to uh, visualize that. So now let us take a look at the look at the country called India here. So now let us take a look at this. So once we zoom into the country India here, you can able to visualize here the places in the points layer it looks kind of uh, messy here. So now I will use my mouse to zoom in until I think they are starting to separate uh, if sufficiently. So let me do that here. So now here the place has been uh, appears to be uh, sufficiently separated. You can able to visualize. It's not ca kind of messy here. So in the scale of one is to three million. So you can able to see that here the map scale here. Now let me zoom this out here. And now here you can able to visualize the place appears to be uh, sufficiently separated. So in the scale of one is to seven million. So now I will type as 1 is to 8 million as my exact scale here. And make sure that you add some comma here. So now click enter. So now it is in currently in 1 is to 8 million scale. And now it seems to be okay. And now I'm going to use the layer property to allow only places to be displayed when the map is zoomed uh, at this particular scale of 1 is to 8 million. So for that we're going to navigate to this layer places. We're going to right click and click this option called properties. So now in the general tab uh, I will set its visibility range to not show places when the map is zoomed out beyond uh, 1 is to 8 million. So now navigate to this option here out beyond. We're going to click this arrow here. We're going to select this uh, particular scale 1 is to 8 million and now click OK. So now navigate to this option here. We're going to click this option called uh, fixed zoom out. So now click this option here fix zoom out. So now here you can able to visualize the places are no longer visible here. So the labels only visible in the scale of 1 is to 8 million. Let me show you that. So it is in 1 is to 8 million. So now the places have been visible here. So now let me show you once again. Let me click this option here, fix zoom out. And here we are at 1 is to 9 million. So now the places have been not visible. So now let me make sure that we're going to click this option called for the full extent and make sure that whether the labels are not, not visible. So you can able to clearly able to view that. Now the places uh, labels are not visible. So we have made a the layer in and label visibility depend depends on the map scale. So now let me zoom into this particular uh, map scale of uh, 1 is to 8 million. So now I can able to visualize the places. So now I will change my scale to 1 is to 5 million and see that whether they are visible in that scale. So now let me set my scale to 1 is to. Now let me click this option here called customize. So here I will uh, add my scale. Now let me type here as 1 is to 5 million. So 
So once you did that, we're going to click this option called add to the scale list. So here, the one is to five million is visible. Now click this and click OK. And now here, you can uh, navigate to this option here. Click this arrow here and choose one is to five million. So now it is zoomed into the scale of one is to five million. So now the place is being visible here. And now I will go back to the scale of one is to eight million. Click this. Now again, go to this option here. We're going to select one is to 20 million here. So now we don't see the label here. And uh, that's because the label only shows when the layer is within the scale range for the display. So we have set the scale range to be around 1 is to 8 million. So the label is only visible if the scale range is within 1 is to 8 million. And we set places to not to display further, not uh, more than 1 is to uh, 8 million. So now let me zoom into 1 is to 8 million here. Let me click this and show you this 1 is to 8 million. So in this video, I have shown you how to make the layer and label visibility depend on scale that is map scale in RGIS Pro. So thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel and give us a like.